So welcome back to JS Madras. In this video tutorial, we are going to see how to combine individual layers to a single shapefile or single layer. So as you can see on the display, there are a lot of shapefiles are available. So these are uh, individual files that should be combined together as a single layer. So for that, I am going to use the tool called as merge. So that can be found in the arc toolbox. So this is one of the method to find the tool. So once you open the arc toolbox, uh, now you have to select the data management tools. Under that, you can find the option general. Just uh, click on the general. You can find the option called as merge. So this is the tool. So there's an uh, other option to find out this tool. You can see the option search. So control plus F. Now here you can type in the tool merge m-e-r-g-e and hit the button search so this is the second method to find out the tool this is much more easier to uh, browse the tool and uh, make the analysis so now click on the tool so this is the tool which is going to be which is going to combine the multiple input data sets and uh, make it to a single file so now we are going to input the data sets so as you can see on the uh, left hand side of the uh, screen these are the layers which is going to be combined together so this can be uh, done that is uh, it can be done manually uh, using the drag, uh, drag and drop button uh, you can just select uh, one at a time so that is the drawback from that otherwise you can directly hit the uh, first uh, layer and uh, select the last layer using the shift button so that the files will be selected together just drag it and drop it down here so the layers will be available here you can also browse the layers and bring it to the uh, to the input data sets so that can be done using this uh, button so the next thing is that we are going to specify the output location of the file so we need to select the output location using this folder you can just select it select the output location where you need to save the uh, file that can be done using this option so here i am just uh, leaving as it is because this is just the default uh, geodatabase and uh, you can always change it and you can see the option called as field maps here you can uh, remove files for example sorry you can remove the fields for example you can see the add mode i'm just removing it Likewise, you can add or delete the fields here. And finally, click the button OK in order to proceed it. So now you can see the process has been going on. So it will be taking uh, 5 to 10 seconds in order to complete this process and bring it to, uh, bring it to a single uh, layer. So now you can see here. The multiple files has been combined to a layer so um, I'll put, I'm going to show you how it has been done so once again I'm going back to the layers here I'm going to turn off the fields now I'm just uh, keeping the final result file so you can see here this has been combined to a single shape file I'm just opening the attribute tables here you can find the details of the attributes so they are around uh, 13 uh, shape files that has been combined together you can see here so these are the files 13 sh uh, different uh, shape files which has been combined together as a layer so if you have any doubts in this uh, uh, video please do ask in the comment section i will be answering to your questions so thanks for watching gs metas